This is MMA Outbreak. All right, guys, a lot of talk recently about the Ultimate Fighter season coming up, so I figured we'd go ahead and break the odds on the Ultimate Fighter um, coaching staff here between Uriah Faber and Dominic Cruz. The trilogy, uh, to complete the trilogy, which takes place supposedly at UFC 148. Now, it could change, but right now that's what we're hearing, which is on July 7th, and it should be another tremendous battle. Their last fight was close. Um, Dominic Cruz is going to open up the favorite, and we're going to start off with Nick Thompson here on this fight. Dominic Cruz coming in at minus 215. The comeback is going to be plus 165 on Uriah Faber. Nick, what do you think? I'm a favorite fan. I'll be cheering for him, but I think I've got to go with Cruz. Cruz, uh, you know, his last loss to Faber, he then comes back to the UFC after that fight or the WEC. Hasn't lost since, nine fights in a row, and seems to get better every, every time. Um, I, I think we'll see an even better Cruz than we did the last time we fought Faber. And I, I don't even know if this fight will be all that close. I, I'm hopeful it is because I like Faber, um, but uh, i got to go with Cruz. All right, so you're going to go with the favorite, minus 215. Again, a little bit more competitive line than we've seen on the show so far. Um, but it, he is still uh, laying 1075 to win $500 on the favorite, Dominic Cruz. Now, Derek, what do you think about Uriah Faber and Dominic Cruz, the trilogy? Uh, I think it's, you know, it's another close fight. Uh, I think this is pretty much a pick and fight. Uh, I, I personally thought Faber won the second fight they had. Um, I thought he landed better shots and, and you know, he was more aggressive. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to take him to win, to win the, the third fight here. So I'm going to take Faber. All right, so you're going to go with the underdog here, plus 165. It's going to be 500 to win, 825. It was a very competitive fight, and a lot of people do think that Faber did win the last one. So it's kind of a controversial decision. Um, it's going to be competitive, and again, supposedly it's going to take place UFC 148, the headliner there, Cruz versus Faber 3. Well, that's it for another episode of MMA Odds Breakers. You can look for the odds that Nick broke right here on the show to start popping up at the sport books throughout this week. And a big special thanks to our two guests, veterans Derek Noble and Nick Thompson welterweight talent right there for you and for those that want to keep up with the mma oddsbreaker show make sure you follow us on twitter at mma oddsbreaker for miguel literati i'm nick Kalika saying until next time enjoy the fights